11, 10, 9, eight, seven, eight, six, five, four, five, four, three, three, Atlas engine ignition. Two, three, one, one, zero. And And lift off of the Atlas 2AS rocket carrying the NRO L1 payload skyward, continuing the legacy of support to the United States National Reconnaissance Office. Let's listen to Rob Gannon as he provides launch vehicle ascent data from the ASOC Engineering Operations Center here at Cape Canaveral. The program is in right on time. We have Atlas PU to close loop control valves moving as expected. Booster sustainer engines burning normally. Ground lit SRB signatures look good. Everything is operating normally. We are peaking out on ground lit SRB chamber pressures, right as expected. Normal city state pressures, booster sustainer engines. Coming up on burnout of ground lit SRBs. Ground lit SRB burnout. Burnout signature looks good. We have ignition of airlit SRB, startup signature looks good, burn is looking good, booster sustainer engines right as expected. Coming up on 10 seconds to jettison of the groundlit SRBs. Booster sustainer burning normally. Groundlit SRB jettison is confirmed, everything looking good. Airlit SRBs are burning normally. Peaking out on chamber pressures, signatures looking very good. Booster sustainer engines operating normally. Atlas PU is looking good. Coming up on burnout of airlit SRBs. And we have burnout of airlit SRBs, normal signature. And the separation of the final two Castor 4 SRMs completes Thiokol's record of 100% mission success for Atlas. Booster and sustainer engine operating normally. We are now firing the outcome system in preparation for BECO. PU to open loop control. We have booster engine shutdown. And the last rocket dying booster engine separates cleanly following a perfect two and three quarter minute burn. Sustainer engine is burning normally. Next mark event we're looking for is bearing separation. And bearing separation. Normal signature there. Both brake wires indicate a good separation of both bearing halves. Ten seconds to Seco. We have sustainer engine cutoff. And stage separation marks the end of mission for the last Atlas sustainer. We have pre-start on Centaur fuel and locks. Nozzle extension complete on both engines. Everything working good. We have format change. We have ignition. And full thrust, both Centaur engines are up and running normal. Everything looking good. Good start signature on both Centaur engines. We have Centaur PU to fixed angles. Everything looking good. We are now in the beginning of a four and three quarter minute burn of Centaur. And Nico 1, normal shutdown signature, both engines are down. We have 4S settling thrusters on. We have ignition. Full thrust. Both main engines are up and running normally. Good startup signatures. Coming up on Miko 2. We have cut off. Normal shutdown signatures will click the normal GCS signature. 4S thrusters are on. And we have spacecraft separation. Vehicle is spinning down. And with 
the successful spacecraft separation. This concludes the commentary for the flight of AC-167.